Hello guys, um, I've decided that I'm going to black out the badges on my car here and I'm going to do the chrome sills around the window so I'm going to black out anyway, I'm going to try it peels off so let's see how it turns out this is the um, product I use called Carlas what I use, but Plasti Dip is pretty much the same thing. Colourful rubber spray film, it comes in several different colours. You spray it on the car or whatever you're trying to spray. Leave the first coat for five minutes, so you just do a light coat. And you spray again, leave that for five minutes, spray again, leave that for five minutes. And you pretty much do that until you think it starts to look like what you want it to look like. I've done one coat so far. A light coat, so you want 50% so you can see 50% black, 50% white. That's what I went for anyway. Do another coat in about... Two minutes. I'm about to apply what will be my final layer, hopefully, on this section of the car. I'm gonna apply it, wait for about 30 minutes, and then peel it. So, I'm about to start peeling it off. So I spent ages working away. And as you can see, it's turned out exceptionally well. The hardest part was peeling the the um, film from around the green, but as you can see, it turned out all right. I could have done it better. I think I'll leave this on for a while, then I'll redo it in the future. But for now, I'm just doing my door sills. So this one's done. Just peeling this one. Done two coats. Let me just show you what it's supposed to look like or what the car actually look like, looks like. So it looks like this chrome. So I don't really like it with chrome. So I blacked it out. Quick update for you guys. This side is complete, looking funky fresh. Let me take you to this side. So this side, I've done one layer and I ran out of paint. So. I'm going to need to go get paint tomorrow, it's bank holiday so I'm not sure where it's going to be open that I can get uh, the same paint but I'm going to make an effort to and then hopefully I'll have it done for you guys tomorrow and then you can check it out. Hello, I'm back and I finally, finally finished. Um, Plasti dip in my car as you can see This is the badges. Let me take you on a quick tour. Oh, so you can see I plastic dipped around the windows as well I did this badge this badge. I decided to take off because it was too uh, Too intricate and small to do on this side again did around the windows I left the center of the window the gloss black just because I thought it was a nice contrast I might do it later, but I think gloss black looks nice against the matte black um, I made a little mistake, I'm going to have to redo, but it just peels off, if you see there. It just peels off, so it's not even a big deal. I think the hardest part is the preparation. When I say that, I mean like getting the car wrapped up and protecting the windows and the paint from um, overspray and stuff. But other than that, it's not too bad. I'm like, I wouldn't say I'm a painting expert, but I painted before, but not like at this scale. But well spray painter that is but I think that I did pretty well and I think that anyone could pretty much do it as you can see I'm looking very rough I did wake up at 9 a.m. this morning to get more spray paint and uh, I've been doing this since it's about three now basically I did one and I took it off because I wasn't happy with it I'm quite OCD like that and then um, yeah I got it looking good so I'm quite happy with it now so when it came to what I did I think I did four or five coats on everything and it looks really really good but yeah this is the product it cost me 10 pounds for um this uh, 400 milliliter can. I'll probably say you should get two, even if you're just doing a small part, because um, it's not that expensive and it also means that you have backup in case you make a mistake somewhere. And it also means that if you decide to do more things, you'll have some extra. So I, I definitely recommend getting two. And eventually you're probably gonna wanna top it up anyway. Um, they don't give a time that it lasts for on the car or on products, 
but I guess it's just down to how you use it and the conditions that the car's stored in and whatnot. But I feel like it should last probably upwards of half a year, if not a year. But I'll keep you guys updated on when I update it. Um, when I update it, <laughs> I'll keep you guys updated on when I um redo it and stuff. Uh, but yeah, this is a product that I, I definitely will use again, and I will use it on my future cars. So you want to be a player, but your wheels ain't fly. You gotta hit us up to get a pimped out ride. You got